Welcome back everybody to another episode of some building big witch room. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little time lapse at the very beginning of the episode. We were getting all the cliffs worked out for the rest of the castle, I think. I think that's all the cliffs we have to do. Got it all the way around here. We may have to do, yeah, I think we have to do a bit more over here, actually. No, I don't think so, because the castle, there's gonna be a tower coming straight up from here and a wall from there. So I think we're pretty much done with all the cliffs. But anyways, I want to thank you guys for all the support on the last episode. I really appreciate it. I had a lot of welcome backs and a lot of people that really seem to like the castle. So thank you. Thank you guys for that. Really appreciate it. Uh, but in today's episode, I think I want to do a little bit more work on the castle. I'm not sure how much we'll be able to get done because I'm going to have to go get a bunch more copper. Uh, we used pretty much all the copper on this section right here that we have. We got a little bit left, but this isn't going to get us very far at all. So definitely going to have to go get some more copper. Um, so that'll probably be something I'm going to do in a stream. The stream will be before this episode even comes out. But again, if you do want to catch my streams, though, go ahead and follow me over on Twitch. There'll be a link in the description to my channel over there. But yeah, that's probably the kind of stuff we're going to be doing in those streams. Just doing a bunch of material gathering because there's a, again, there is a lot of stuff I need for this castle. Uh, so that's what we'll be doing over there. And I like to check out the snapshots every Wednesday on stream. So if you want to see that as well, uh, go give me a follow. But yeah, so before we get into any building today, oh, actually we have quite a bit. Oh, no, that's not, that's not copper. Never mind. Uh, let's go ahead and put this copper in here for now. You can see I've gotten a few of the uh, oxidized version of the copper uh, because it's been actually changing pretty quickly. Like I'm really surprised at how quickly the the copper stages change. I think they might have changed it at some point uh, in one of the earlier snapshots because I've been struggling to keep up with it because I want to wax. Uh, I, I'm leaving a lot of these unwaxed so they can change into this state, uh, but they're going so quickly it's hard to keep up. So I have gotten a couple of these, the weathered, weathered cut copper and oxidized cut copper. And it looks really cool. I am, I think I'm definitely going to have to make, if I can get a ton of copper, I think I'm definitely going to have to lay out just like a bunch of them somewhere in the world. So I can just get a bunch of these blocks and a bunch of these blocks because they're super, super cool. All right. So something I want to do really quick before we get into any of the building for today, because we're going to, I think we're going to try to knock out another big section of the castle today. Uh, maybe on, uh, I don't know. I'm not sure which side yet. It would probably be best to do this side over here. Uh, so it doesn't feel so empty from this side, uh, since we got most of the castle on this side done already. So that's, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what I end up deciding on later on, but let's kind of lay out the roads here so you can get an idea of what it's going to be like in here. So we're going to have a road coming straight through the middle here, wrapping around a little bit, wrapping around through here a little bit. I think there'll be a courtyard about here ish. Uh, there's going to be a couple buildings right here and then a building all along here. And then it'll turn real sharp and go over this way. There'll be a little covered bridge that you go, go under that's connecting two buildings. Uh, and then over here will be a building and then obviously the entrance into this building, which is going to be the throne room. I think this one is going to be really, really cool. Uh, very difficult to build an interior on an angle, but I think we should have no problem with it. So yeah, the road will kind of curve around through here. This isn't exactly how it's going to be either, obviously, uh, but that's kind of the idea. So we'll have some buildings here, buildings all along here, obviously, and this is just going to cut through the entire castle pretty much with a little bit of a courtyard in the middle here. So yeah, it's going to be really, really cool. I'm excited to get it done. But now what I want to do really quick is, first of all, get rid of this floating thing that I never noticed before. Get out of here. But I want to head back over to that underground cave, that giant cave that we showed in the last episode. And I want to talk about some of the ideas that people gave me in the, in the comments of the last episode because there were some really good ones, some really cool ones, and I want to talk about them a little bit. Well, as long as I can find the entrance to that cave, uh, let's see here. <laughs> I'm going to have to make some sort of actual entrance to this cave once we actually start building something down there. I'm thinking maybe, maybe like a lighthouse just on an island out here or something. So maybe some kind of tower or something like that. Uh, oh, is this it? Wait, what is this? I don't think this is it, but this is a hole. Okay, I've definitely been here before. Interesting. I don't think this is the way I want to go, though. I think I want to try to find the actual way in. Okay, here it is. I finally found it. I had to fly all the way back to the uh, the mainland and then fly back 
just so I could remember how long it took to get here. Uh, but yeah, we got it. We got it now. Now you go away because I do not want this area blown up, please. Okay. So yeah, here it is. Here it is. By the way, I had a couple people say I missed the ores when I was in here. I, I said in the clip that I didn't want to get the ores. Uh, so yeah, don't worry about that. I, I, I might get them someday. I don't know. I, I kind of want to just leave them though. They're kind of cool. Kind of a cool look for the area. I don't know. I'm definitely not in need of any diamonds. I have like five stacks of diamonds in this world right now. But yeah, this is the cave. If you missed it in the last episode, this is the cave that we're planning on building in at some point in the future. I got a lot of really, really cool suggestions, some stuff from, uh, some inspiration from Skyrim, from uh, Dungeons and Dragons, stuff from The Hobbit. I think it's gonna be really cool. I think I am gonna go with the elven, kind of elven theme, um, at least somewhat elven theme, maybe more gothic than elven, I don't know. But a friend of mine, Pride Ceratob, sent me some references for a city in Dungeons and Dragons or an area in Dungeons and Dragons. I don't know how Dungeons and Dragons works, but something from Dungeons and Dragons. Uh, but it was a big city. It was really cool looking. It had a bunch of like glowing purple roofs and they were all really pointed, at least the, the reference image I saw. But I think it could be super, super cool to have something like that. Could make you it could make really good use of the amethyst the new amethyst blocks that were added to the game, and then maybe even try to work in some purper. I've never, I don't think I've ever once used purper in this world. And I've been playing in this world since before purper was added to the game. So I don't know, it could be cool to try. It could be cool to try to do something with that. I don't really have a good like vision of how I'm gonna do it in here yet, uh, but I still think it's gonna be really, really cool. I might have to cut out a chunk of this just so we can get some more height. Uh oh, just so we can get some more height in the buildings. Uh, because if we only have this like line here where we could have tall buildings, it might be a little, a little, uh, I don't know, restricting. So we'll see, we'll see what we end up doing. I'm not exactly sure. I know you can't speed mine this stuff. So that might be, that might not be a route we want to go with. <laughs> So maybe we'll get to work on some of that stuff in t the next episode, maybe. As long as there's not like a giant snapshot released that we want to go check out uh, for the next episode, we might come back here and start doing some building. Well, I guess we could do both. But if you do have any more suggestions uh, for stuff we could do here, let me know. Please let me know in the comments down below because I am open to pretty much anything here. Like I said, though, I think we're probably going to do a kind of a mix. Elven. Uh, a little bit of gothic probably, maybe some, maybe a little bit of dwarven to have some mines in the cliffs and stuff like that. Ooh, and I just had an idea. Okay, I'm getting ideas. I just had an idea for the tower that we were talking about earlier above, above the entrance here. Could just be like a giant ruined tower using a lot of the uh, grimstone and a lot of the other new blocks. Oh, and using the copper too. Okay, okay. Yeah, we got some good ideas, I think. We got some good ideas here. But yeah, again, let me know. Let me know any other ideas you might have for that build down there. I think it's going to be really, really cool, though, whatever we decide to do. But I think what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go ahead and get to some material gathering because we need a lot more copper again. Uh, so I'm going to get to work on that. I think I'm going to do it on a little live stream, like I mentioned earlier. And once we get back, we'll start doing some more work on the rest of the castle here. All right, we're back and it is the next day now. Actually, I think it's been two days maybe, but I did do a stream yesterday and the day before. I'm recording this on Thursday. So I did a stream Tuesday and Wednesday. We built these two towers up and then did a little bit of messing around in the snapshot because we got a new snapshot, of course. But yeah, so we're making some pretty good progress on the castle here. Let's go ahead and hop over here and check it out from here. Yeah, it's looking good. It's looking good. It'll look even better once we start getting some of the buildings on the inside. So we'll have rooftops sticking out of the top here have that roof connecting over to there, of course. And it's gonna be looking really, really cool. Uh, so I think what I wanna do today for the rest of this episode, I think I wanna try to wrap, oh, by the way, you can see there are definitely some terrain changes that have been happening in this, uh, in the snapshots. We got some weird, weird borders here. Uh, but what I wanna do for today's episode, I think I wanna go from here I want to build up all this wall all the way from here all the way around to that tower right over there. So that's going to be quite a bit of work, but I think we could do it. I don't think it's going to be too, too difficult, especially, I mean, it's all stone and like tough and cobblestone. Uh, so it's not like we're going to have to do much material gathering. And I think there's only one tower over there that needs another copper roof and then this big tower right here. So I think we should be okay on materials as well. 
I mean, I think we should be okay on copper as well. So I think I'm going to go ahead and jump into a time lapse of that right now. And we'll be back once we got this all the way wrapped around. All right, guys, we're back and we have made some really good progress today. Got the exterior of the wall all the way completed for the most part. I still need to add the top of the tower on this, uh, this tower and then the top on this tower as well. That one is just going to stay just like that. There's not going to be a roof on top like that one is. Only these two still need roofs. But yeah, we made some really good progress today. I'm very, very happy with what we got done. I was kind of hoping to get some more terraforming done around the castle for this episode, but I think I'm pretty much out of time for this episode, unfortunately. Uh, but I am going to have a bunch of trees around the castle here, wrapping all the way around. May do some other stuff too, I'm not sure about that just yet, but that is going to be the main goal. And then obviously once we get the towers on there and start seeing some buildings on the inside, this place is going to start looking really, really good. The main reason I am done for today's episode though is because I am pretty much completely out of materials. I still got all, all kinds of stone and stuff, but copper, I am running very, very low on. You can see this is all the copper I have left right now. This and what I have in my in inventory, obviously. Uh, but this stuff is pretty much useless for this build. I've been going through and replacing, well, I think I mentioned in the last episode that I was leaving the spots that were supposed to change to this stage, this stage of copper. I was leaving them unwaxed. Uh, but they go so, so fast that it's so hard to keep up with. So it has been very, very annoying. Uh, definitely, whenever I do the rest of the roofs in this castle, I'm definitely going to have to have a different method to doing this. Whoops. I think I'll probably just have to lay out however much I need of this version of the copper and then just harvest it once it's all, once it's all ready. And then we can craft it into all the blocks that we need. But yeah, like I said, that is going to have to do it for this episode. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And again, I did do most of this work over on Twitch, uh, on my Twitch channel, streaming it live. So be sure to go follow me over there if you want to see the progress of that. And yeah, that's going to do it. Hopefully you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And I will see you all in the next episode. Whoops. Goodbye.